In July 2009, the NGO world emerged as an e-platform for the NGOs to share information and highlight humanitarian issues. The devastating floods of 2010 pushed the selfless, devoted, and energetic team into the practical field in Laya and Muzaffargarh districts in the south of Punjab. As the ancient proverb goes to say, where there's a will, there's a way. The NGO world's resolve to serve found its way when their strong level of commitment and quality of work was noticed by the Turkish donor agency, Lighthouse Foundation, who decided to aid them to carry out the entire flood relief operation. Together, they built houses, provided biosan water filters, and educated people about basic sanitation and hygiene, rebuilt all the 22 NCHD feeder schools, and revived the local livelihoods by rebuilding 100 carpet weaving rooms and providing raw materials to the artisans to start the work. All made possible by the devoted, passionate and humble team of the organization under the untiring and visionary leadership of Mr. Zafar Iqbal. Visit Adamwali today and witness how magical the combination of vision and passion can be. Over the years, the man-made shelters have transformed into self-sustaining settlements. Every day, the spirited students walk for miles by the riverbank, then get aboard a trolley and finally onto the boat to reach their school located in the heart of the mighty Indus River. ये स्कूल अहले इलाका के लिए रहमत है दूर दूर से बच्चे यहां पढ़ने आते हैं मैं आप सब की शुक्रगुजार हूं कि आपने मेरे गांव में इतना अच्छा स्कूल तामीर करवाया है कहां साडा वसैल नहीं जरावन के असा इना बच्चा को पढ़ाऊं उथवन के शहर दे विच असा नहीं पढ़ा सकदे साडे बच्चे पांच भी पास करके ओ वला जे रहे फजूल थी बात आफ्टर द रिवाइवल ऑफ द फीडर स्कूल्स इन द फ्लड अफेक्टेड एरियाज the NGO World initiated the ZEST program to enhance the quality of life and to enable talented students to fight off all sorts of oppression, suppression and discrimination in the poverty-ridden rural areas. The program is a tribute to a devoted teacher who was once successful in planting the love of learning in his students, who are now giving back to the society and also paying tribute to their great teacher through Zakaullah education, support and training. Following the footsteps of Honorable Ustad Zakaullah, these humble yet extremely successful setups provide the essential religious element, thus offering a beautiful blend of tarbiya and modern education. The flourishing network of Zest schools in the area and the ever-increasing number of students belonging to both genders prove that true and innovative imparting of education makes its own way. Seeing the Zest scholarship holders join higher seats of learning and proving themselves in the metropolitan is a reward in itself. In Arabic, Rida means one favored by Allah and Chadar cloth commonly used by the local females to cover themselves, symbolizing modesty. This beautiful name was made more meaningful when the females of South Punjab were given the long overdue attention by the NGO world. In a society rife with biases against female education and empowerment, Rida College and Rida Vocational Training Projects offer a much needed, healthy and vigorous change in the otherwise disadvantageous lives of women. Getting education seems farcical on an empty stomach. The NGO world realized the essentiality of provision of basic human needs to be able to take the next step in human development. This is where the Barkat project emerged in 2012, according to the principles of Islamic microfinance, thus bringing more Barkat into the lives of the beneficiaries. We have a lot of families, 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 families,
گائے یا بچڑا دیتے ہیں ایک مخصوص مدت کے لیے اگر گائے دیتے ہیں تو وہ تقریباً تین سال اس کے پاس رہتی ہے اور اس دوران اس کا دودھ بھی سیل کرتا ہے اور آخر میں جب اس پروجیکٹ کلوز ہوتا ہے اور جانور سیل ہوتے ہیں اس کا بچڑا سیل ہوتا ہے تو اس کو ایک مناسب منافع بھی مل جاتا ہے Surrounded by vast stretches of citrus orchards, without any contact with the outside world, these islands of poverty were provided with a means to self-sustenance with the help of Dikka, a Turkish agency. The vulnerable and poor segment of the community of Kabirwala was provided with livestock to maintain and reap the benefits in an attempt to attain self-sustenance and social uplift. تقریباً کوئی بہتر ایک ہزار روپئے کا ساڑھے دو سال ہو گیا ہے جہاں کوئی آٹھ مہینے سے بیچ ہے اس تو بعد موڑ جہاں سے گاؤں دوبارہ جہاں سیل کی تھی وہ بھی ساڑھے اٹھارہ ہزار روپئے نفع آ گیا ہے بہترین کام میں پینا چلانا چاہیے تھا سلف پنجاب از ہسٹوریکلی لنکڈ وتھ لائف اسٹاک فارمنگ اینڈ تھرو دا پروجیکٹ دا لوکلس گیٹ ٹو ارن بوتھ فائنینشلی اینڈ سائیکولوجیکلی بائی انگیجنگ دم ان اسٹیجس اینڈ مچ اسٹیمڈ ہیریٹیج آف دا کمیونٹی be it the Ramzan and Qurbani packages for the deserving or the entrepreneurial and leadership workshop for the underprivileged youth. The invaluable chain of philanthropists across the globe is kept intact through regular events, trainings, conferences and workshops for NGO officials. The network is effectively strengthened by the innovative initiatives like the Greater Goods magazine, the directory of NGOs and the annual celebration of World NGO Day. The NGO world is a platform for all like-minded organizations to strive together for a happier and brighter future. Live for others, they say, and while doing so, make life so much more worth living for all of us.